Conrad Francis is one of the directors of Inspired Money. A business was born from passion to bring information and awareness to all those seeking a fully transparent financial planning and consultancy business. Conrad is also a basketball coach. His passion to build sustainable relationships around financial accountability is high on his agenda and also continues to speak publicly on his topic into organisations, schools and other group meetings. But tonight, right now, he's speaking to us. Thanks, Sylvia, and thanks, Lucian. Talk about being dwarfed. At least you went to university. I, I dropped out. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I also uh, didn't completely finish my Diploma of Banking and Finance and I also have the, uh, the bare bones of a qualification to run the finance companies that I run. Okay, and, and that's a big joke in my office. Um, clearly, uh, I don't subscribe to not getting an education, but mine was, uh, was done through a hell of a lot of uh, mistakes and hard work, um, which is a way that a lot of people have done it. Uh, my story, I guess, or well, the inspired money story, uh, started about three and a half, four years ago um, when my previous business partner pretty much emptied my pockets to the tune of $20. And that's, a, that's an evaporation of a million and a half of life savings that went away in a, in a, in a period of time. And my dad passed away just, just uh, about a year before that and my relationship with my partner broke down in that time frame as well. So adversity. Um, I faced a lot in 12 months. Um, and I had to ask myself that question, you know, what is it that, uh, that was going to make me or break me? And I had a phone call from a client uh, who still is a client and has done some amazing things. Uh, and they said, Conrad, build it and they will come. And so I, I, I started with Inspired Money and uh, I, uh, I gave 50% of it away to two staff that are now my fellow directors. Um, and we've gone in four years from $20 to convincing the AMP bank to lend me 150000 with no security. Um, they will never do it again, but <laughs> they did it then. Um, and we I mean, top line, you know, what do they say? Um, ca cash flow is king, you're exactly right, Michael. And um, the, the, the line I heard was um, turnover is uh, vanity and bottom line is sanity. Um, and, that's, and that's something that, that's been the mandate in our business. And, and we will turn over um, a nice six, so seven figures this year in four years. Um, and from Inspired Money has also uh, come another little JV with uh, Peter Peard and the Peard Realty Group. So we've now also got Peard Financial Planning on a, under our stable. Um, I've also then, now been contracted to manage a national group uh, group's office in Perth here because they like what we've done. So that's Partners Wealth Group, which includes a legal office. Um, uh, Guild Financial Planning, and we've just taken a stake in a business down in Mandra called Meridian Wealth Strategies. So that's, that's what four years can do um, if you, you get out of the way of all the naysayers and all the negativity. Um, so when Zishan offered me the opportunity to be a part of the Success Academy, you know, it, it was trying to figure out what did I have to offer and I, I guess um, what I do do, particularly with the, with the people that I do work with on a consultancy basis, is, is help them stay focused, um, help them weed their mind of, of the thoughts, uh, help them um, stay accountable and, and that's a very interesting word, and I know it gets used a lot. And I guess everybody on this panel will probably have used that word in times with themselves and, and with their teams around them. But it's one that I believe uh, gets forgotten um, about its true meaning. Uh, and it's a word that I, I, I do value quite a bit. And if anybody rings my office and, uh, in a, office and asks for a word to describe me, they'll, they'll tell you that I'm, uh, I'm accountable. So if anybody wants to have a chat to us later about uh, any of the dramas and trials and tribulations I've got, a gazillion stories. Um, I'm happy to share any of them. Thanks very much.